extensor carpi radialis. Okay, that's for the long longest. The lateral uh, supracondylar ridge. Okay, uh, is the at the, the the carpal two. It's at the base. Okay, is the distal um insertion. Or the carpal two, the muscle is it extend and ABD adducts the wrist. I'm going to be showing you uh, the soft stretching exercises uh, that you can do at home. Okay, for the extensor carpi radialis longus and brevis. Okay, um, there's only a very little, um, there's, it's very similar but a little deviation to it. Okay, so your arms or your elbows are sh um, straight or extended and uh, it's pronated. Okay, and you're gonna uh, flex your wrist and you're gonna put pressure onto the second digit. Okay, so using some flexion pressure, okay, and you're gonna hold that stretch for 30 seconds. You should be able to feel a stretch, and I do feel a stretch right now. Okay, and you're taking a break. For 30 seconds or one minute interval okay and you're gonna be doing this every day three uh three times okay so making sure that um it's a three set i'm only going to be showing you one set okay but i would like to see you do perform the three set that way i can see if you're doing it accordingly and you're performing them in a safely manner okay so for doing the stretching exercises um we want to make sure that we're holding it um for 30 seconds Okay, and we're gonna do three sets. Okay, I'm gonna show you and I would like for you to copy me. Okay, what I do. So three sets with an interval of 30 seconds to one minute, okay? I would like for you to do this every day, three times. Okay, so again, 30, you're gonna hold it for 30 seconds and you're gonna do three sets. In those three sets, you're gonna take a 30 second to one minute interval. Okay, a break, you can take a sip. You can um, make sure that you are in a good posture, you're breathing normally, and it's important that you're wearing something comfortable, okay? It is a must to hydrate, and it's a must to wear something comfortable. These exercises should be pain-free. In the event of a discomfort or anything, please make sure that you call your doctor or you can call me, okay? Before we proceed, I would like to uh, make sure that you understand everything I said. Do you understand everything I said? And do you have any questions for me before I proceed?